Howdy. How are you guys doing? I'm in Littlefield, Texas, and really tired, as always. Um, made a last-minute decision yesterday to fly out. Um, only flight I could get was 9.45 uh, p.m., which means I can't pick up my truck until 6 a.m. because it was in storage. However, my flight got delayed to 11.20. Didn't get to Denver till 2. Got to sleep around 3.15 and got up at 5.20 and then just drove eight hours um, to my target in Texas. Needless to say, I'm looking forward to the storm today about the same amount as I am to a bed tonight. Um, but today's um, kind of a marginal. We might have a supercell to chase. It might look good. It may not. Um, tornado is very iffy. Could be outflowy, but um, slight risk in the panhandle. May you chase it. And tomorrow, maybe we get lucky with a southeast moving um, storm. I'm not sure exactly what that one's going to look like, but any southeast moving storm is worth chasing. So, um, almost any. But we'll see what happens today. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I've never been so frightened. Oh, he's too far away now. Let's go stand on the hill over there. Got a storm. Kind of in New Mexico, trying to get over here. The problem is we also have an outflow boundary coming, which I think is there. You can kind of see it. Hard to make it out, but there, dust. It's either going to kill these storms or it's going to do something awesome and enhance them. I don't really know. All right, well, our storm that I should have stayed gone back south on has got a nice little hook on it. Oh my gosh, I can see it over there. Um, some rotation on the backside, so I'm trying to get there. can see it but the structure is real nice. We love right here baby. What can you do about this? This is what you call top tier. chasers or people that live in the town that drove away.
yesterday was amazing. Um, as a guy who likes to time lapse, uh, it's a it's a struggle when you see epic wedge tornadoes right from you know quarter mile away or something, and you're not there. If it hadn't been dusty yesterday, uh, I would have had a great, amazing time lapses with the tornado in it. Uh, but it was freaking dusty. But structure is off the charge. Time lapses are great. So here's a little sneak peek. I'm sure you watched the uh, video already, uh, but this was uh, one of the shots I took with that plane of just insane. So you can see here that, you know, this is where we were, and or at least where I was, and it's just so dusty. And the wedge is right in there, you can kind of make it out. I have another shot that I can I'll show you, but this actually had some pretty spectacular lightning. Um, I got a couple of shots that I really like. That's one of them. There's a big one though that I'll be, that's right there. I'll probably post that one. This thing is amazing. Um, while the wedge is going down, which if I drop a little dehaze, which I don't use ever, but if I drop a little dehaze, you can kind of make out that there's a wedge in there. Although it doesn't look as much there. It's hard to see in this one, but pretty crazy. But this is the time lapse of it, the wide time lapse. Um, you know, and it's great. It's dusty. It's a really nice foreground. And so. You know, when I'm out there time lapse and I have to make a decision on whether I really want to get right underneath the storm and um, uh, get a tornado shot close, and that's about it, because usually it's just rain and hail underneath, or if I want to do this, and this is what I love to do. So this was just a great time lapse, beautiful, beautiful structure, especially like here at the end. And then you can see this dust, like it's really hard because it's fuzzy, but you can see the dust ripping in on the left there is just um, spectacular. The rest of the day was um, great. Uh, this this scene not so much, but this is just a beast, a honking beast. Um, wonderful, wonderful, you know, stuff right here, and um, and it just kind of got better too. So um, all in all, not too bad of a day, and um, some great time lapse clips to to have for the next film. I'm pretty happy.